So here we go. Big Adventures with Dino Dave. And it's by Holly B. And it's illustrated by a man by the name of Brian White. David Temple is my name. They call me Dino Dave. I work at this museum, the place that is my fave. Dino's tower far above, and children squeal with glee to see how giants walk the earth and how they used to be. The Paleo Lab is super cool. It's filled with volunteers. They learn to coax a fossil from where it's been for years. He is a surgeon, now retired. She plays in a band. That guy's a mechanic, and they're all glad to lend a hand. So we have lots of volunteers that work in the lab, and they're from all walks of life. It takes a gentle touch to find the fish inside of stones, dig out their fins and scales and teeth and all their tiny bones. I like to volunteer my time and learn a new skill. I like to talk to visitors and use this tiny drill. As Dino Dave went from the lab, a girl tugged on his sleeve. I want to see a dinosaur. Yes, that I can perceive. They wandered up and down the halls, her green eyes opened wide. I want to see it all, she said. Will you please be my guide? I'm honored to, said Dino Dave. There's so much here to see. Nature is a wondrous thing. I'm sure you will agree. Lane is our Triceratops. He really is a mummy. He ate lots of plants and shrubs to fill up his big tummy. Of all the world's Triceratops, he is one of a kind. He's the only one with skin preserved. He is a super fine. And we do have that. We have a lot of his skin on the wall. His bones are real, said Dino Dave. They're not made from a cast. The sample of his skin reveals a secret from the past. And I wonder what that secret is. We thought that Triceratops had skin as smooth as smooth could be. But we found bristles in these bumps. Observe and you will see. This is our Diplodocus. It munched on plants for snacks. It was a gentle dinosaur that left enormous tracks. We are really very proud of Dipsy, the first in our collection. But what is that upon his hip? It's time for an inspection. These are some marks upon the bones. We think they're from a bite. It may have gotten wounded when it got into a fight. This big guy is known as Wyrex. He's the biggest of them all. One of the biggest in the world. He makes me feel so small. His hand and feet are well preserved. The best in the, all the land. No other T-Rex has a bone like this one in his hand. If you're a Tyrannosaurus Rex, your tail is long and strong. But this one's tail is different. It seems that something's wrong. He could have lost it in a fight. It must have hurt a lot. One thing's for sure, said Dino Dave, his balance would be shot. Our Megalodon is known as Meg. She terrorized the seas. The giant shark would make her mark a frightening sight to see. With nearly 20 dinosaurs, from huge to very small, it takes an entire day or more for you to see them all. Our fossils are amazing, teeth and bones and claws. Here's a poop from a dinosaur, and here's some saber-tooth jaws. It's time for me to head for home, but there's so much more to see. I never want to leave this place. It's where I want to be. Thank you, Dino Dave, she said. I've learned so much from you. When I grow up, I want to be a paleontologist, too. These dinosaurs will all be here, and more are on the way. Come back real soon, said Dino Dave. I'm here most every day. The end.